was going. And I always had a really good relationship with Hulk Hogan. And I would have done anything for him. You know, if Hulk Hogan had said, no, I need you to do me a favor or whatever it is, I mean, I was always really respectful and I appreciated his um, contribution. And uh, lo and behold, like five months or four months pass, and uh, I have this good match at Wembley with the Bulldog. And, Suddenly, I'm the champion. Like, it was so quick and sudden for me. And I always remember, I was thought, Hulk Hogan would probably be really proud of me and really be happy. And I, you know, I hope he, he's happy that, you know, after him, you know, because I think he thought it was going to be the Ultimate Warrior show. And I don't think he was a big fan of Warrior. I don't think anybody was a big fan of Warrior, <laughs> except for his Warrior fans. You know. <laughs> but none of the wrestlers really cared much for Warrior. Never thought of him as our champion ever, but uh, Hogan, we we all believed he was our champion. We had a lot of respect, and you know. So when they put the belt on me, I thought, well, at least Hulk Hogan would be proud that they put the belt on a guy that worked really hard and <clears throat> who earned it, not necessarily like Warrior and somebody that um, has been there day in, day out, 300 days a year for I think even nine or ten years at that point. So I always thought, well, someday I'll see Hulk and he'll be really proud of me.